All right, all right, I know, I know, I know. I went MIA again, I'm sorry, all right? You guys know I always come with an excuse, so you know I'm gonna come with an excuse again. My excuse this time is, if you've been following me for a while, you guys know I uh, I took a pretty lengthy few month break from this game. It was just, it wasn't fun to me anymore. Uh, and when I came back, I felt like I was not good at the game. And I felt like if I wasn't good at the game, then my content wasn't up to what I wanted it to be. That being said, if you play the game, you know that survivors have had 100% boost since Wesker came out. So I've been playing a lot of Survivor. And not this bullshit, yeah, I've been playing a little, I've been playing a lot of Survivor. Between Wesker coming out and the rank reset, I don't remember exactly when Wesker came out, I literally went from Ash 2 or 3 to Gold 1 or 2. So I played a lot of Survivor. So I'm why I wouldn't say I'm the best obviously that's fucking egotistical I'm in a happy place with my skill that I feel like I can upload so this is just gonna be a I'm back video I'm gonna be I don't know what I'm gonna be shooting in the video what I'm gonna be saying to you guys but let's not stare at this boring ass wait screen and let's get some content while I talk to you guys Oh, the game map. Rip. Ignore, uh, my windows of opportunity. I've been messing around with new perks. I was using, uh, basic bitch hyper focus. Is that clown? But I was using basic bitch hyper focus to grind out gens, and I was like, you know, this is boring. Let's try to get a, uh, a running build going um so to fill the void pretty much told you guys why I took a break I was uploading small clips here and there and that was like actually from me playing the game I just thought oh like that was kind of cool or that was funny or whatever I don't even remember a lot of what I uploaded but um yeah I really want to get back into uploading I want to get back into trying to upload Dead by Daylight every Wednesday um, and then I know I upload a majority of Dead by Daylight, but anyone who's new to this channel, I've said before that I don't want to be a Dead by Daylight only channel. Um, I want to be a variety channel. Basically, I just upload whatever I feel like uploading. Uh, if I'm being completely honest, I know it sounds like a douchebag thing to say, but I would rather you guys subscribe to me for me. And subscribe to me because you think I'm entertaining or you like me or my personality and not subscribing to me just because I played that by daylight now I'm not saying that's a shitty thing to do because I myself am like that where I'll subscribe to someone Dead by Daylight as an example I subscribe to someone because they're really fucking good at Dead by Daylight I'm not gonna name anyone and then they'll upload a not Dead by Daylight video and I'm just like I'm not watching that shit Ooh. So yes, I still consider myself a variety channel. What I want to do is I want to try to get into, I'm not going that way, get into the motion of uploading Dead by Daylight every Wednesday, and then some other week of the day uploading like a let's play of another game, or just like a random one-off game or something like that. Um, what comes to mind, exactly in this moment would be alien isolation that's one of the first games i started on my channel and i've i've started playing that game like six years ago or some shit and i don't think i'm even close to beating it um so that's something like just throwing out this isn't what i'm going to be doing yet because i don't know but just throwing out an example i'll upload dead by daylight every wednesday and then every Oh, that's pinky finger, isn't it? But I'll upload Dead by Daylight every Wednesday, and then I'll upload Alien Isolation every Sunday. And then, I guess really I can do something like, uh, if I ever have a one-off game, I'll upload that on another day. Like, Sundays are dedicated to playthroughs, Wednesdays dedicated to Dead by Daylight, I don't know, fucking... 
Tuesdays dedicated to uh, oh this random game that I wanted to try and make a video about you know something like that uh, so let me know what you guys think I like I know it's cliche as shit but I really do actually fucking read the comments and try to do what you guys like and what you guys prefer like there's a while there when I wasn't sh oh fuck when I He's trying to pinky finger me. Fuck, he got me. Uh, there was a while there when I was actually not shitty at uploading, and someone on PS4 or well, PlayStation, just period, kept like sending me messages of like, "Hey, look at this build, try this," or "Look at this build, try this." Um, I did a nurse video about that OP ass fucking build, the one Starstruck, I think it's called. That shit. I learned from someone who sent me a message, and I, sure enough, I plugged him in a video. Hey, I got the video idea from this guy, and uploaded it. Um, now, I <laughs> will say, being egotistical, I, I definitely had to have been the best fucking nurse on PlayStation. Um, definitely can't say that now. I don't play nurse. I really don't play killer. I try to play killer but Jesus Christ that wait time is horrendous and I am not a patient person I think my wait time for killer is a few minutes and survivor the second I queue up I'm in a match it's nice um you have save no you don't have save the best it's I, I can't I played a couple of uh, killer games for a for a riff whatever it's called and that was it and waiting for those sucks but I definitely want to get back into being quote-unquote the best PlayStation nurse because it was fun it was really fun um, and that was I think besides some random ass video of like I did like I glitched the fuck out and that like blew up but outside of that um, my nurse video. I don't know why I did that. My nurse video, like, really blew the fuck up. So. And then. <laughs> my petty ass rebuttal when someone said the only reason I didn't make another video was because it was hard to play nurse. Yeah, we're gonna. Have no, sir. Um, but yeah, no, playing nurse was so fucking fun to do. So I did play her a little bit, like, in my break, but kind of, I uh, not kind of, very much rusty. Definitely need to uh, practice some more with her. But again, if, if you guys, oh, fucking shit. If that's something you guys want to see, please, please let me know. I have absolutely no problem. Um, another, hello. Another thing that I'm thinking about doing is I got the one chip challenge, kind of doing like a um, shit, a breaking it down because typically I upload two uh, trials and thinking about doing like a bra <laughs> fucking blast mine. I love blast mine. Uh, breaking the chip down into... He's coming. No, he's not. Breaking the chip down into... He is coming. Into six pieces. And then doing a... Um, oh, you bitch. Every time I get hooked... I... Take a bite out of the chip. Or take a bite. I eat one of the chip pieces. I was gonna do it if I lose the game. I would take a bite of the chip but I want the chip to actively be fucking me up like I want the chip to mess me up in the game why the fuck so I figured getting hooked would be the best idea on that one um I actually didn't realize we got four gens done on this clown and that's why I hit the game map she had to fucking travel oh this is awkward we need to heal up. Where's the third generator? We have two gens just chilling right next to each other. 
I almost feel like if I don't go save, no one will, but I want to get one of these gens done. What sucks is, yeah, all he has to do is camp those two. That sucks. I have dead hard. Will it work, though? Oh, it did. That was lucky, but I wasn't expecting it to work, so I just ran back and fucked myself. And there's no pallet back here, and they threw the pallet up here already. That sucks ass. The man's keeps shaking his head, and I don't know why. Oh, there's a hook right there. Yeah, we have two gens next to each other. That sucks. We need to find that third generator and get it done. Because he can literally so easy hold down these two gens. I hate that you can't hear the heartbeat if you're hooked. I should think that's a bad idea. Let's go over here, just because I am an easy target on last hook. So if he comes up there and sees me, I'm fucked. I'm going to assume he will check back on those gens, and I'm going to go try to find this third gen. And sure enough, there he is, checking on it. I figured he would. That's done. It's probably gonna be the first floor, right? Yeah, I hear someone working on it. Awesome. You have the same idea. Fuck. Oh, that's. Yeah, I figured. Damn, and a waste of a pallet. At least that's your first hook. has like nothing now he has to have pop right that's crazy um i'm gonna be honest with y'all i don't i don't have a good feeling about this oh let's talk about the new patch update the new uh what behavior released about the new stats uh it's nice that the killer actually has some pressure now rather than just getting fucked because i truly truly felt like as killer you just get fucked up survivor was so much easier before but now like it actually honestly feels what the fucking shit it like it actually genuinely feels hard as survivor now If they can go pressure that other gen and I pressure this gen, we can get out of here. Or he's gonna chase me. I have plenty of pallets if he wants to chase me right here. I will fucking use- No! Go to the other side! What the fuck is wrong with you? Oh, sweet baby Jesus. Oh, that's why you did that. My bad, dog. I didn't realize overcharge. They changed it that overcharge, uh... What's it called? He's shaking his head at them too. Um, the overcharge skill check doesn't sit there like before. Hopefully he goes that way. Yes, he is. He's gonna kick the gen. He's gonna give me time to save. We need to get the fuck out of here. Gonna chase me, right? Oh, I got plenty of pallets. I'm gonna throw this one first. Uh, <laughs> yeah, he's he's gonna go check on that gen, which means I can come over here and work on this one. Nice, 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 nice. Get this nice and open. I don't know if I'm going to chop this up or just upload it all in one. Fuck, he comes over here. Okay. 
Now wait for the hook and then open it in case of Blood Warden. We'll see. I might chop it up. Yeah, he came to check. <laughs> Alright, let's hop into the next game. <laughs> of course, two fucking maps I absolutely despise. I should have switched up my build. Just for some variety. I should have did the basic bitch hyper-focus build. Is that Wesker? Oh. Stretch. I was like, what the fuck? I don't remember that sound. You know, I've been playing a lot, and I literally haven't had Dredge at all. This is the first time I've had Dredge since Wesker came out. I don't know where he is, but, uh, he sounds very close now. Oh, they're right here. I can see his outline on the pallet. The, and I can hear the chains. I never realized you could hear the chains before. That stinks. Oh, basement? Rip. And I'm not going to be able to finish this gen. Double rip. Mm. Get some distance. Maybe I can get him to chase me. Did he teleport? That was very abrupt. Did he kick my gen? Yes, he did. Overcharge, maybe? Lots of, oh, <clears throat> lots of overcharges. you okay if I was him as soon as I would have saw this gen blow up I would have teleported back because clearly that person would be going for the save that was a fast ass heal so what worries me already about this game is a lot of time has passed and no gens have popped I mean, I don't know what they're doing, so I can't talk shit on them. Clearly, y'all can see what I'm doing. I'm, I tried. I'm trying. But that leaves... Jesus Christ. I swear I got better at the game. Maybe I can get him to chase me. But that leaves two people who had no interaction with the killer whatsoever. So a gen should be fine. A gen should have been popped. Jesus fucking Christ, why'd you come back? Interesting. I thought for sure you would have fell for that. Ugh, I didn't think I was going to get that, to be honest. I was going to say 360 because at least try. There's pallets fucking everywhere. What the hell? Oh, that pallet sucks. What are these pallet setups, man? Oh, I actually wasn't going to throw that pallet, but he swung and I saw him get caught, so might as well take it, right? See if I can keep him on to me. I forgot he doesn't have a heartbeat in this. Okay, I'm gonna see if I can finish this.
cool thing about the obsession is you can see they're clearly being chased. Very scared, but I am prepared to press X. Oh, they're way the hell out there. So the scary thing is this gen and that gen are going to get popped right next to each other. The one in the house I heard was pretty high up there, maybe 60, 70%. I don't know if this was this Dwight or not. It probably was, honestly. I probably accidentally sandbagged this Dwight. I wonder if they have barbecue. Stop streaming on my ear, please. Thank you. See, it disappoints me that I had two interactions with the killer and I... Oh no, what the fuck? I didn't realize the gen got popped. I was going to get ready to talk shit and say I had two interactions with the killer and I popped the first gen, but no. one has been popped. I'm going for the save, I suppose. Hope they don't see me. They did not. Gonna unhook you. I heal you because you're on your last hook already. So you get prior or okay, I guess you heal me. I feel like it'd make a lot more sense you were fully healed, but mm -hmm. I'm gonna run straight up there. What gen got popped? I don't think it was that one, because I don't remember a gen being popped during the nightfall, I think it's called. Please go for the save, Dwight. I don't want to. God damn it. I'm going for the save then. He's going to go finish that gen. He's going to go for the save. I'm going to go pop that pallet. Or pallet. <laughs> gen, I guess. Or there's a gen right here. I don't know why I went this way. <laughs> I guess I'm getting my uh, benevolent points. And there's Dwight again. I gotta go take aggro. I have to save this Dwight. Those are gonna be fucked. Oh my god, that sucks. I think we lost this game just off that alone. I wish Dwight would have gone and saved. He probably was on this gen and they came back to this gen. Oh. I'm gonna pop this. It must have been the main building, the preschool that got done. I'll pop this, and then that means the one over by Shaq is our last one that we'll have to go grab. One of us honestly should be taking a hook stay right now for uh, whatever his name is. I don't remember his name. Rebecca and I should be taking a hook state. Yes, it's only a second hook, but I mean still, her and I both don't have a single hook. Good, she knows, she knows. He's 100% gonna probably camp though. And get this 99 does it just in case. I don't know why she's going into shack, but. I can afford it. Oh, he opened the fucking door, you son of a bitch. 100%, he's gonna camp, that's why he opened the door. Makes the most sense, doesn't give us time to save. I mean, we have plenty of time, but that's what I think is about to happen. He wants to run the clock. For some reason, I thought Rebecca went in the shack for something and then, like, somehow opened up a gate immediately. Or, like, I was like, did she open up hatch or something? Like, what the fuck was that? I swear I'm not new to this game. Why does it feel like I hear I was going to say, why does it feel like I hear him? That's an easy out, right? Easy out. Got him. All right, GGs. Ugh. I hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, <laughs> I hope you welcome me back with open arms. Hope you guys welcome me back with comments, what you wanna see. 
uh, what you guys think about my idea on the uploading Alien Isolation again. Um, yeah, and I catch you guys in the next video.